and that went down again, which is what we want it to do. We pride ourselves here at Nebraska Medicine for offering a comprehensive myeloma service. That of course starts with the full diagnostic approach and then moves on to the comprehensive uh, management through uh, multiple collaborative departments and services that partake in the uh, total care of multiple myeloma patients. Including radiation oncologists, pain medicine specialists, orthopedic surgeons, nephrologists, and any other physicians that might be helpful in the treatment of myeloma. Multiple myeloma is the second uh, most common hematologic malignancy in the United States with a rising incidence and prevalence uh, globally as well as domestically. Myeloma uh, manifests itself um, as a problem of plasma cells that invariably involve the bone marrow, uh, but not just bone marrow, uh, but also other organs including kidneys, including effects uh, on the different cell types in the blood, uh, whereby they may also predispose myeloma patients to various infections uh, through impairment of immunity. I think there are several things that distinguish us from others in the region. Number one, we do have two multiple myeloma specialists here at UNMC in Nebraska Medicine. Uh, the second thing is that we have a clinical trial portfolio, which is really important for myeloma patients, both in the newly diagnosed setting and also in the relapsed refractory setting. We are a uh, academic institution that participates in a large number of clinical trials and working very hard uh, to launch an investigator-initiated trial here at the University of Nebraska Medical Center for all multiple myeloma patients. We are very excited, I have to say, about this, not only from the standpoint of potentially being able to prolong the use of these very important medications for myeloma patients, but also because we may perhaps, depending on the results of the trial, be in a position for the very first time uh, to identify a biomarker of uh, proteasome inhibitor resistance for multiple myeloma. Right now we have several very important clinical trials for myeloma patients. We are taking advantage of a clinical trial that uh, introduces one of the most recently developed myeloma drugs, daratumumab, which has really proven to be a blockbuster in the treatment of relapsed disease, but is now available uh, in clinical trial only form in newly diagnosed patients. We really pride ourselves at offering the latest treatments and the uh, newest trends in the care for multiple myeloma. Also very glad to offer a second opinion review of cases with multiple myeloma, amyloidosis, or any other form of plasma cell dyscrasia to patients who are also abroad through our Office of International Health Services. Another thing that distinguishes, I think, our myeloma program here at Nebraska Medicine from perhaps other care that's received in the state is the multidisciplinary team approach. Together, the physicians, the mid-level providers, the pharmacists, the case managers, all of us come together to provide optimal care for our myeloma patients. This is truly an exciting time to be involved in multiple myeloma care and research. It is quite possible to imagine in our lifetimes a future where we will be able to provide cures to patients with multiple myeloma or at the very least provide a very long-term durable remissions for patients which would allow them to uh, return back to their normal lives.